Um, I'm Jack Collins, and before I'd like to explain my hypothesis and aims, I'd just like to have, give a little bit of background as to why um, they are important. Um, so, so yeah, so I'll be investigating um, how metformin um, could be used as a quorum sensing inhibitor. So to start off, quorum sensing um, is a ability for a bacteria to act as a multicellular cellular organism through uh, gene expression. So at certain cell densities, um, bacteria will produce um, certain proteins. Some of these proteins could be toxins um, or whatever have you. Um, and so in essence, what it allows bacteria to do is it allows it to be a lot more uh, effective in what they do. And so if you have uh, one cell that's all alone and it starts producing something, um, that one cell alone can't do much. But if you have um, a lot of cells together um, working towards the same thing, then it can actually do some damage to that organism that it's in. And so thus, quorum sensing allows the bacteria to be a lot more um, dangerous and effective. And so here we can kind of see a little bit, um, a quick snapshot of what quorum sensing looks like. You have this Lux I um, that produces this AHL, and AHL will bind to Lux R uh, when a certain density is reached. And so when Lux R has the AHL, it acts as a promoter, um, and then the target genes will be expressed. So that's kind of gist of what we're talking about. Um, so quorum sensing, quorum sensing inhibition um, is important because if we can stop um, this Lux R from producing these target genes, um, we can take away its, its effectiveness. So it blocks their ability to communicate, it blocks um, the uh, bacteria's ability to yeah, be effective. And so in, in essence, we'd be tricking the bacteria to be alone. Um, so my hypothesis is, if metformin is placed in the presence of uh, Pseudomonas ag agronis, then its quorum sensing ability will be inhibited by competitive in inhibition between metformin and autoinducers for the Lux R promoter. Um, two aims of this would be to further explore FDA approved drugs and their quorum sensing, uh, quorum sense inhibiting ability. Um, and the second aim would be to, de to determine how the toxicity of Pseudomonas organis is changed in the presence of metformin. Um, if we go back to this real fast, uh, metformin um, in this slide, if this was to be introduced anywhere, it would be introduced where the AHL is. The AHL is the, the auto-inducer, and the metformin would uh, have competitive inhibition for the Lux R protein. Uh, it would bind to it, um, and as, in essence, take away a spot for the AHL to bind. So, yeah. Here are my references.